last subject about the Brexit. I hope Vice Johnson's got it right. On the 31st of December, we're going out the we're going out the Euro market. We're going out as we're a single country. Does he realise that? Have we got it right? Have we got it right in this country to do that? Does he realise we might not be allowed in the Eurovision Song Contest? Because it's Euro, isn't it? European countries are in that. Right? And uh, we won't be allowed in Euro- European football. We'll be chucked out at all. Does he realise that? Our farms can't cope. They've not made any produce in England for years. Right? We don't make anything in this country. What do we What do we make in this country worth, worth doing? Apart from garden sheds. And my dad says about, you know, we make garden sheds. That's not very good, Dad. That don't help. Right? We're going out the single market. We'll be a single currency again. Right back to 1970. When I was born in 1977, we were a single currency. We were doing well. We ain't now. We are in a mess. England's in a mess. Yep, England is in a mess. It ain't, it ain't, it ain't because of COVID, we're in a mess. We don't make anything in this country worth, worth saying to the rest of the world. We don't. We can't play football. When do we win the, when do we win Euro football? And, and when do we win the World Cup? We don't. We don't make, we don't mount to nothing in football. We never have done. We never mount to nothing in this country. And our government keep talking, keep talking balls, keep talking rubbish, telling us we, telling us we get out of the COVID. How do they know? They're talking balls, right? The prices in this country are too dear. Things are too dear in this country. You go to other countries, it's cheaper to live in other countries than it is in England, right? And our food banks in this country are not open. In America. Donald Trump opened all the food banks in America. They're all open. Every single one's open. In England, none of them are open. Because they're all moaning. Don't moan. There's a lot of, de- lot of people who need, need their food. Need food for the winter. Right? Don't keep saying, this ain't a... Because the uh, Salvation Army done my in the other week. They, they my, my care manager, my... my uh, my support worker, Jane Stevens, are telling off the other day, this ain't a food bank. No, I don't care what it is, you're there to help people in times of need. If that's not the case then, why are they called Salvation Army? Why do they help people then? Why do they? Because they, they won't get out, were they? And I wanted food. Right? And they were moaning. They moaned to Janet. Don't keep going at Janet Stevens. Well, I'll get out of here and put a bad, bad report about you on YouTube. And I am going to as well. The Salvation Army are crap. They're a crap service. They're a crap service. They're a crap service. They moaned about Janet Stevens. They may be helping, but they're moaning to Janet Stevens. And she took a food bank voucher in there. Well, I thought it was a food bank. I thought that's what it was fucking for. But they didn't want to know. So, if they're not a food bank then, what are they doing for people on the street and like me with no money? What are they doing then? Why are they not helping? What, what's, their, what's their purpose? Their, their, their status? Who, what do they do to help people outside? What do they do? Nothing. They don't give people food, do they? They were moaning they give donations to people. Give, give you a rest. We need food, mate. Right? Don't keep stacking up here. You ain't a food bank. You are a food bank. We got a coronavirus over our heads. Ain't over our heads, mate. The world's in a mess, mate. And you're moaning about giving us food. Just give me some food and g- get on with it. Shut up, fucking uh, Salvation Army. I've come down here for food. Right? And they moaned at Janet Stevens. Because it wasn't a food bank. But what is it then? What's their purpose if they can't help? By Johnson again, isn't it? He done this again by closing our fucking food banks. Right? He closed them. 
We need fucking food. We're down in, we're all down in our fucking money round here. He closed the food banks. Not many of them were open. In, in America, yeah? Every, every food bank right across, right across the state of America are all open. And they're really pushing it down in America. All the people on the street, yeah, are getting food every day. We're not. We're not getting food. Because Boris Johnson's a tight hard bastard. He's tight. He's more worried about going out of Brexit in a single market. He's worried about that. Sod the Brexit. Stick with the coronavirus, mate. Stick with the coronavirus. Work out that. Not the fucking Brexit. We're not interested in that. You silly div. We don't want to know about the Brexit. That's why Theresa May resigned. Because she, she didn't want to do the Brexit. We don't want to know about the Brexit, by Johnson. I couldn't give a damn about that. I want to know when we're, when we're officially over the coronavirus. When it officially is gone. I don't want to know about the Brexit, mate. We got that hanging over our head, the fucking COVID. We don't want to know about the Brexit. That's not the subject we're on about, mate. He was on about that the other day. Tell us more about the COVID-19. COVID he did vaccines and get to us in Medway. Are we going to see it down here in Medway, in the Medway towns? Never mind your bloody Brexit, mate. That's what he was moaning about, the Brexit. Don't worry about that. That's, that's not, not, not a subject worth worrying about. That's nothing. We got a virus hanging over our heads. A virus hanging over the whole world. And you're worried about the fucking Brexit. Big fucking deal about that. We don't want to know about the Brexit, mate. Stick to the coronavirus and tell us how far we're going to get, whether we're ever going to get past this, this damn virus. Never mind about your fucking Brexit that you kept going on about. That's all he was on about was Brexit on the news. I don't want to know about Brexit. I want to know if that... That pan, that virus fucking uh, uh, jab, the the vaccine is gonna get to med, get to Medway the Medway towns. Are the Medway people gonna get it? Can ever receive the the vaccine? We ever gonna get receiving it down here? Are we gonna get it in Medway? No, he's more worried about the fucking Brexit. Are the people gonna get a vaccine? Yeah. Well, prevents fucking COVID-19. Are we going to get it in Medway? And Mason ain't got it neither. We want to know if he gets down here in England. If it gets here, we want to know if it gets to us. But he's more worried about the fucking Brexit, about going to the single market. Never mind that. Never mind that, you div. Never mind the, the Brexit. We don't want to know. We couldn't give a damn about that. What us public people want to know is that, that damn virus is going to get right across the board. That damn, that damn fucking uh, vaccine.